Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you seven of the easiest Amazon work from home jobs that I've found over the last few years. And these are some that you can search for if you're trying to find something that's easy to apply for. All of these of course pay at least $15 an hour or more. Many of these do not require much experience or a college degree to apply in many cases. So you can go to amazon.jobs of course to search for these. Now a lot of these are not going to be available right now but some of them it just depends on when you see this video when you check and things like that um, as far as what you're going to look for what you might do is just go down to the bottom left and look for work from home that'll at least narrow things down to just work from home jobs now you can also narrow down by country as well for instance if you're in the united states and you want to work from home you might just do that and then you can just see only the ones that apply there but then you have categories and all of that but I'm going to make a page for you as kind of a reference point as well so you can use that to just kind of copy and paste the names of these jobs into amazon.jobs when you get the chance and then you can see what becomes available and I will also use the YouTube channel to notify you when they are hiring for some fairly easy work from home jobs as well. So, so one that you can look for is the executive assistant AWS strategic accounts position at Amazon. And I've taken notes of each of these jobs on selfmadesuccess.com. So that is the page, that is the website that I am using for this. Again, I will put all of these in one page for you and keep track of the best Amazon work from home jobs for you that you can apply for without having a lot of qualifications. But what you'll do with this one is you manage multiple complex calendars and scheduling requirements. You track and help drive completion of key deliverables and following up on outstanding items, update team organizational charts, manage group logistics, coordinate travel, participate in planning of events, and work with other assistants th throughout the AWS team and across the rest of the company. Qualifications, high school or equivalent diploma, two plus years of experience assisting at the executive level, and experience with Microsoft Outlook, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, SharePoint, and Visio. Preferred qualifications but not required would be a bachelor's degree, ability to think and plan ahead, delegate responsibilities, manage time effectively, ability to handle confidential information with discretion and deal with professionals inside and outside the company, experience with reconciling expenses and booking travel and exercising sound judgment, exceptional written and verbal interpersonal communication skills, ability to work in a highly ambiguous environment, compensation and benefits. So from my research, you can expect around $25 per hour for this position according to reviews for this position on Glassdoor. Uh, you get a training budget, paid vacation, performance bonuses, access to co-working spaces, health insurance, technology stipend, physical and mental wellness programs, and family leave, which a lot of those benefits will apply to most Amazon jobs. But again, this is the executive assistant, AWS strategic accounts. Uh, many other executive assistant positions will probably be very similar as well. Another one to maybe look for in the future is the chat stylist advisor position. So this particular position, um, what you'll do is chat and style with direct contact to customers via chat, video, and new virtual platforms. As a chat stylist, you must be intuitive and creative with virtual product to create custom looks for customers, whatever their needs. Candidates must be able to understand a broad customer base, be highly skilled with curation, trend, and fit knowledge, and speak to the latest fashion. Utilize styling ex expertise, trainings, and data and internal software programs to provide world-class fashion recommendations to customers. Offer expert styling advice that inspire men's and women's customers through thoughtful curation of outfits, build and retain a strong customer relationship by answering multiple concurrent inbound chats from customers with a positive, enthusiastic, and conversational tone and solution-oriented men mentality. So essentially, you're going to give like fashion advice and help them via chat support. So it's kind of like part fashion, part customer support via chat. Qualifications, an ideal candidate will have experience in chat, clientele, sales, and have a de real desire to make a customer's shopping experience engaging and seamless. You must strive a startup environment where they bring creativity, new perspectives, and an ability to navigate an ambiguous and changing business. You should also be highly motivated, independent, have a passion for customer service to styling, in styling and fashion. 
They don't mention a lot about benefits and things like that, but you should be able to expect around $26 per hour per, for this position based on my research using Glassdoor. Another one you can get is a styling assistant job. So I mentioned the chat stylist advisor, a styling assistant, also part of Amazon fashion. Uh, at this job, you'll be tasked with providing world-class customer service to fashion customers. Uh, make around 15 plus per hour. There are no benefits mentioned for this. It is more something you could get part-time when I have seen this available. And then required qualifications, one plus years experience in customer service chat, one plus your relevant fashion-based experience, which can include retail sales, styling, personal shopping, online styling, editorial styling, etc. High school diploma or equivalent, exceptional communication skills, including the ability to clearly, concisely communicate in writing and speech, as well as listen to and interrupt customer needs, a strong fashion knowledge base, including an array of brands, designer styles and trends, history of staying up to date, knowledgeable of current and fashion and future fashion trends through such mediums as social media, print magazines, blogs, online, etc. Good time management, organizational prioritizational skills, flexibility with full-time schedule, including shift assignments on weekends and evenings, strong interpersonal skills, basic knowledge of Microsoft Office Suite, familiarity with multiple web browsers, window navigation, and instant messenger tools, a high level of fashion, a passion for fashion and styling, and possess flexibility to quickly adapt to changing customer and business needs. So you need to also be, I mean, it would be preferred but not required. Fluent in Spanish, other CS experience like calls and emails, associate of arts or bachelor's degree and keen eye for detail and high level of accuracy. Now they also have just like kind of basic customer support type jobs here. And what they usually call these is technical support associate or customer support associate. So you can you can search either one of those on amazon.jobs and usually these will pay you know around $15 per hour to start. It's one of the easiest things you can actually get at Amazon for working from home. But what you'll do is help a variety of Amazon customers by phone, email, and chat support. You'll support customers through typing phone and computer skills by navigating the internet and website, multiple pro browsers, email, social media, and instant messenger or chat tools. Again, $15 an hour, usually an overtime pay at 1.5x base rate. Employee discount, which is also really nice with this. So if you become a customer service agent working from home, you can still get an employee discount with Amazon, which pretty much has everything for sale, and then resources for a living program. Required qualifications. Now, usually they hire in the U.S. from what I've seen with these, but obviously they're a worldwide company, so that can change. Support a full-time working schedule of 40 hours, up to 60 high school diploma or equivalent, so no degree required, and fluent English language proficiency required. Preferred qualifications, previous customer service experience and previous call center experience, not required, but preferred. Technical requirements, they do have some here. A lot of times they don't have technical requirements, but for this, if you're doing customer support, a minimum of 10 Mbps download and five Mbps upload speed from a reliable internet provider must be directly connected to router or modem via ethernet cable, cannot use a wireless connection. You'll also be shipped an Amazon-owned laptop headset and Ethernet adapter and two security tokens to the address provided in your application. And when applying, please be sure to verify that your mailing address in the system is an address where you can receive equipment. So that is kind of what customer support, just basic customer support looks like at Amazon, not for a particular department like fashion. Now you also have something fairly similar as well called the HR content center associate so this is kind of like customer support except it's for people who work for amazon so it's kind of like an hr customer support type position you can also look for this one it's usually not super hard to qualify for this either 18 dollars per hour to start usually and what you'll do is serve as the first point of contact for leave disability and accommodation related questions take ownership of employee contacts ensuring that each contact is accepted and resolved with a high degree of customer focus, resolve queries by referring to documentation such as frequently asked questions and standard operating procedures, and escalate when these cannot be resolved, build customer trust through empathetic personalized conversations, receive queries via phone and log contacts into the shared service case management system, and work closely with partner teams to keep up to date on process changes, partner for quick resolution of cross-functional issues, and consult to improve processes. Again, it starts around $18.50 per hour, and then they have a benefits page. I'll give you a link to that as well. Required qualifications, three plus years of contact center, customer service, human resources, or equivalent experience, proven ability to use Microsoft Office, 
uh, demonstrated proficiency handling customer contacts, queries, and res resolutions. Obviously, now this one was for the US. It can vary depending on where you qualify because the, again, they are worldwide. Preferred qualifications, four plus years of contact center or equivalent experience, not required, but this is just preferred. Previous experience working in virtual environments, basic US legislation, leave of absence and accommodations knowledge, one year of leave and or accommodations experience, and that includes a lot of different things. Knowledge of US federal and state leave and disability laws, previous HR experience, proven ability to manage customer contacts in a fast paced environment, proven ability to adjust to constantly changing workloads and the ability to follow existing process with high attention to detail. Technical requirements, pretty much the same exact things as a typical customer service gig that I just showed you. Now, another thing you can look for is like a customer service representative for a different side of Amazon. So like for instance, Ring, which is the doorbell service that they acquired. They're kind of the parent company of Ring doorbells. So this one is very similar to a typical customer support job. It's just another kind of example of what you could look for. So this one's full time, 16 an hour, very, very similar to the other customer support associate and representative jobs I showed you. So I probably won't go too much into detail about this because I pretty much covered all the details of the of similar jobs already. And then another thing you can look for here, they actually do have data entry type jobs here sometimes. So typically what they will call these is like a data associate for Alexa data services or a senior associate for data entry. So you can look for either of these job titles or something similar to that. And you might be able to find just like a real easy typing job for Amazon. And again, you can't make less than $15 per hour Amazon no matter what. So that is the bare minimum that you can make here. Typically these are 15 to $18 per hour, but Usually it'll require high school diploma or equivalent experience with Windows, Microsoft Office, 40 word per minute typing speed with 90% accuracy or greater and proficiency with English or if you apply in another country, that'll change. Pay 15 to $18 an hour. So what you would do as say, for instance, a senior associate data entry, uh, you would verify data and perform data entry, look, look for variances and discrepancies in data for correction, handle high volume transactions in alignment with SOPs, Submit any corrections needed through trouble ticketing, sheriff point, and defect log tracking and consultation with the SME. Ensure data standards and integrity procedures. Respond to inquiries regarding policies and programs, including benefits, attendance, and job transfer. Respond to document requests, including termination agreements, employee verification, and visa letters, and reporting requests from HR and finance. Match findings with data information in the system for the right outcome understand impacts of changes in PeopleSoft system and how these will impact internal and external interfaces, communicate to leads managers on data findings and escalations, and demonstrate highest degree of discretion and confidentiality. Now, these are usually at the editorial writing and content management uh, category or human resources sometimes as well. So again, to find any of these, you can go by category, you can filter by work from home and what country you're in. And then you can just type in the names of any of those seven work from home jobs, seven or eight work from home jobs that I showed you and see if they are hiring right now at amazon.jobs. But those are going to be some of the easiest ones to qualify for to kind of get your foot in the door and start working from home from a, for a great company that also can get you a company discount if you like shopping at Amazon, which is a nice benefit. So as far as what's like to work at Amazon, they have a Pretty solid rating if you go to their Glassdoor page where employees actually review them. They have a 3.8 out of 5 star overall rating. And as far as how their employees rate their benefits, they have a 3.9 out of 5 star overall rating at a 6,600 plus employees rating their benefits. Now, if you want more work from home jobs like these, if you want to do some research on other types of work from home job categories, you can go to selfmadesuccess.com and go to online jobs at the top right. You can see what's hiring now and also go to online job finder. When you go to the online job finder, you will see that there are a lot of different categories here. So uh, I'm trying to compile a list of some of the top work from home job categories that people have been looking for through my channel and kind of compile the top websites and the top jobs for each one of these categories. And then I'll keep creating more and more subcategories, combining them, and then, you know, adding to this list over time. So you might bookmark this page if you if you feel like you want to do some extra research and earn that, I'll get an Amazon work from home job list for you that corresponds with this video. 
And other than that, hopefully this was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell if you want more daily videos like this one. And I'll see you in the next video.